Hi, it's Dan. Today's post is titled, Brand or Dynasty? Reading an industry article, it mentioned how companies are building their brand. After a sufficient amount of time and in thought, I deduced that what was really being discussed was more about building a dynasty. It's not a stretch to believe, and even easier when you see the actual numbers, that a handful of companies own the lion's share of those most popular brands we've all heard of, although in my case, eh, rarely drink. For my career in finance, it all equates to one thing, money. What else could it be? When acquiring companies pay exorbitant amounts to buy a brand name, many times without the hard assets behind it, they aren't stupid and are placing a very large bet on the further success of that brand with little downside. All one needs to do is visit your local warehouse liquor store to see cases and cases of certain wines and liquor too, piled high, only to return days later to see most of it has disappeared. Sands the like of David Copperfield or Houdini. Demand has a powerful influence on the goods and services in which we partake. Recent inflation, demand, for certain items has skyrocketed prices with our only hope that it will turn out to be transitory in nature and that prices will subside soon. I'm not holding my breath. Another article talked about the expectation for the wine biz in 2023. It wasn't the most favorable guesswork I've seen as it did suggest that 2023 might see some sluggish sales. From my vantage point, and what I and a number of others in the business say, people drink when they're happy and they drink when they're sad. Kind of reminds me of the saying by Coco Chanel, I only drink champagne on two occasions, when I'm in love and when I'm not. There's a part of me that would like to get behind a campaign to try to get more people to buy wine from smaller independent producers, then hoping that they don't sell out if their wine takes off. Unfortunately, my social media presence doesn't equate to an earth-shattering impetus to get things changed. I guess I first need to grow my band, my brand, or do I mean dynasty? Cheers.